February is always a short month. In 2025, it also happens to be the quietest month of the year for astronomy events. Hands down, I don't think we'll see a quieter month than this. While we normally get creative to find a good number of reasons to get out and go stargazing each month, the February night sky will certainly be beautiful, but not particularly full of special astronomical experiences. Don't let that dissuade you. Even if you don't make it out for one of these few astronomy events this month, you can still enjoy all the other wonders of the night sky. In particular, bright Venus and dusty Mars are hanging out in the same part of the sky pre-dawn, actually so you don't even need to stay up late. Just get up early. These two planets are always beautiful to see. February 8th, peak of the Alpha Centaurid meteor shower. If you're looking to spot meteors in February, your best bet will be on the night of February 8th when the Alpha Centaurid meteor shower will peak. The Alpha Centaurids typically occur from January 28th to February 21st each year. In 2025, the peak night is expected to be on February 8th. On this night, you can expect to see roughly five meteors per hour. To spot Alpha Centaurids on this night, look for the constellation Centaurus, which is the radiant point. As this constellation is only visible for those in the Southern Hemisphere, sky viewers in the Northern Hemisphere will struggle to spot any meteors above the horizon. However, a night sky app may help in case it's near the horizon based on your latitude. While meteors will appear to radiate from this point, you should be able to see meteors from anywhere in that area of the night sky. February 12th, full moon. The moon will reach full phase. At this time of the month, it is visible for much of the night, rising at around dusk and setting at around dawn. The Snow Moon The sequence of full moons that fall through the year are sometimes assigned names such as the Snow Moon, according to the months and seasons in which they fall. February 16th, Venus at greatest brightness. On February 16th, Venus will reach its greatest brightness, shining brilliantly as an evening star in the western sky just after sunset. This is the perfect opportunity to observe the planet at its most dazzling, visible to the naked eye. Venus will remain prominent for several hours before it sets, making it a stunning sight for both casual stargazers and astrophotographers. February 24th, Mars ends retrograde motion. Mars will reach the end of its retrograde motion, ending its westward movement through the constellations and returning to more usual eastward motion instead. This reversal of direction is a phenomenon that all the solar system's outer planets periodically undergo, a few months after they pass opposition. February 28th, Alignment of Planets. On February 28, 2025, you'll be able to witness a rare planetary alignment featuring seven planets. Seven planets will align in a rare formation. The planets that will be visible are Mercury, Venus, Mars, Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, and Neptune. This alignment is often referred to as a planet parade because the planets will appear in a neat row across the night sky. Timings. The best time to observe the alignment is about one hour after sunset. This is when the planets will be most visible. Find a spot away from city lights to minimize light pollution. Rural areas or designated stargazing spots are ideal. While Venus, Mars, Jupiter, and Saturn should be visible to the naked eye, Uranus and Neptune will be fainter and may require binoculars or a telescope for better viewing. Weather. Ensure clear skies for the best visibility. Check weather forecasts and astronomy websites for updates as the event approaches. This celestial event is a fantastic opportunity for stargazers and astronomy enthusiasts to witness a spectacular sight in the night sky. Close Approaches and Lunar Occultations in February February this year offers another series of captivating astronomical events, Close Approaches and Lunar Occultations. Lunar occultations are when the moon passes in front of other objects in the night sky, from our earthly perspective. Of course, the moon is always passing in front of stuff, 
but certain lunar occultations are notable, particularly when it passes in front of another planet in the solar system. Here are the key events to mark on your calendar, including both close approaches, where the moon appears close to another object, and lunar occultations, February 1st, early on this day. The moon and Saturn will have a close approach, appearing just 57.6 arc minutes apart in Aquarius. Technically, this is also a lunar occultation, but it will only be visible from a tiny part of far northern Siberia. February 1st, that same night, the Moon and Venus will have a close approach, appearing 2 degrees 04 minutes apart in the constellation Pisces. February 6th, Jupiter and the Moon will have a close approach, appearing 5 degrees 25 minutes apart in Taurus. February 9th, the Moon will pass in front of Mars, resulting in a lunar occultation visible from parts of far northern Canada, Scandinavia, and Russia. From elsewhere on Earth, they'll appear as close as 46.0 arc minutes from each other in the constellation Gemini. February 28th, the Moon will pass in front of Mercury, resulting in a lunar occultation visible from Australia and the South Pacific. For those elsewhere on Earth, the pair will appear as close as 20.5 arc minutes apart in the constellation Pisces, assuming it doesn't occur during the daylight hours. February 19th, also called Bode's Galaxy, Messier 81, M81, is a beautiful grand designed spiral galaxy about 12 million light years from Earth. It's located in the constellation Ursa Major and requires a telescope to see but it's worth it on this night when it's high in the sky around midnight local time for most viewers. While February isn't as astronomically bombastic as other months, there are still a few interesting night sky events worth heading out and setting up your telescope for. Do you have questions about these January night sky events? Let us know in the comments. For space updates, subscribe to Secrets of Space.